just about to take a look around the 2002 Fairline Phantom 46 called Forza. A pair of twin Volvo DMD 74 EDC diesel engines, 480 horsepower apiece. Good spec, bow thruster, stern thruster, generator, aircon. Uh, you've got a passerelle with a 250k um, kilogram load limit. Uh, we've got radar, searchlights, teak bathing platform, teak cockpit, new canopy. Um, nicely specified boat in, in good order. And the Phantom 46, the three cabin flybridge cruiser. And it offers plenty of space. This particular one uh, is a cherry high gloss uh, finish inside. You'll note just from the outside, got these nice wide side decks. Space for sun pad cushions, although no sun pad cushions present. Electric anchor winch. But tidy boat. Take a look inside. Okay, so now sitting in the cockpit of the Phantom 46. Nice space, plenty of room. See you a nice teak finish here. And we've then got the steps up to the flybridge. Uh, it's a big flybridge on the Phantom 46. We've got three forward facing seats. You've got um, a sort of wet bar station, fridge, storage. And the, after that, then a um, nice sort of U-shaped seating with the uh, table. There will be photos online, so just check out the website for uh, more details on that. But the bench seat running across the transom, you get four or five people on there in, in comfort. Uh, you'll also note as well, we've got a crew cab. Um, very big, that's a red, which will just take a look inside. So in the lazarette you can see here we've got the uh, generator, exhaust silencers, there's a tank at the far side as well, uh, teak table in here as well and this is uh, it's got the old canopy, old copper canopy as well which it isn't in bad condition at all, um, perfect for winter use but you can see there just how much storage you've got, absolutely plenty. Let's move inside. This is the saloon on the Phantom 46. Very bright space. See these big windows all over. These ones nicely finished with the Venetian blinds. And also it gives you a good impression of this high gloss cherry finish. And of course you've got a leather Seating area to both port and starboard within this dark grey carpet, all of which is in very good condition. So the windows to port and to starboard, both electric windows, let in plenty of ventilation. And of course, with these big patio doors open as well. You do feel like you're bringing the outside inside. You see you've got some engine access through the floor here, which we'll take a look at at the end of the video. But what I like about this model is the galley is in there with the saloon. So it's one small step down and you're in your galley. You've got storage through the floor. Well, I like the fact that the galley is part of the saloon. It, you know, you're not sort of tucked away. You're part of the, the whole party where everything's going on. And the, you know, the, the aesthetics of it all sort of fits in very seamlessly. Nice clear helm position. Take a sit down in the helm seat so you get an impression of the visibility.
mentioned at the start of the video, we've got bow thruster, stern thruster. Um, there's a remote for this. There's also a remote for the passerelle. Um, we've also got Wi-Fi on board um, with it as well. Uh, Raymarine RL80 chart plotter radar, uh, SD6001 autopilot, and your basic SD60 tridata. Okay, let's go down into the cabins. Okay, so now moving into the cabins. Just coming down this short flight of stairs. I'll point it out because the stairs lift up. Underneath, we have some excellent storage. I've seen in the past, these have been fitted with uh, washing machines um, or just, you know, it's a good place for things like hoovers and um, yeah, spare bed linen. Bed linen. Um, anything, uh, any large items that um, you normally struggle for space, but a very handy bit of storage in there. So the first cabin down the flight of stairs to starboard is a twin cabin. Got two single berths, large hanging wardrobe. We do also have ensuite access the toilet compartment, which is also doubles as the day head. So you've got a separate shower stall with a revolving door, uh, an EcoVac toilet. You just see here as well, more high gloss cherry, lovely Korean style worktop. Everything as you would expect from a Fairline, it's, it's very nicely finished. Such a good space as well. Six foot plus headroom in the shower. And big enough, certainly big enough to be used on a daily basis. But this also, as I mentioned, doubles as your day head. So we go out this door, back in to the companionway. And opposite to port, we have got the bunk cabin. Again, hanging storage. Got a nice little bunk cabin, perfect for a couple of kids. And then last, but by no means least, we've got the master suite. Large island double bed, I mean, this is a big bed. Not sure you get the full scale from the video, but hopefully you can. Like everywhere, beautiful finish. Plenty of storage again. And of course, you do have your own private toilet and shower compartment. Like the day head, but very similar, um, a very similar setup. Got your enclosed shower, your eco back toilet, Corian worktop, nicely finished, and plenty of space. Okay, let's finish up by uh, opening up the engine hatch and take a look under there. So if we can see, there's a nice tidy engine room down where we're looking at down here. Got a battery box, big chlorifier coming off the port engine. So you can get a closer look.
Okay, so in summary, we've been taking a look around the Fairline Phantom 46 Forza, built in 2002, powered by a pair of Volvo TMD 74 uh, 480 horsepower diesel engines. A nice example, in good condition, uh, good spec, got generator, bow thruster, stern thruster, uh, chart plotter, radar, autopilot, got, uh, nice features like the passerelle, got the teak cockpit, big flybridge, three cabin flybridge boat as well. If you're looking at upgrading from perhaps um, something flybridge or sports cruiser just with the two cabins, the family's getting bigger or you know friends are coming with you on uh, weekends away and you want to accommodate them then she could well be worth a look. Currently lying with us in, here in Brundle. Um, nice boat, full details can be found on our website at www myA.co.uk. Uh, just click the uh, link for used boats and you'll find it on the first page. Thanks for taking the time to watch. I hope you've enjoyed the video.